Okay, so we're going to change the SSD hard drive, which we're going to upgrade to 32 gigabytes. And this is on a Dell Mini Netbook. And I think this is the uh, Inspire, uh, what is it, 910? Camera's not focusing, but that's what it is. All right, so this is what we need, the hard drive and this. And actually, I already did the job, but I'm just gonna show you how to do it. Basically, you just take these screws off, don't lose them. So it's pretty easy. The only hard part it is, is finding uh, one of these uh, bits that is small enough, I mean enough and pointy, so it doesn't uh, warp the, the screws. Okay, so you just take it out. So you can see, you just pull it off. It clicks a bit. And this is the, the hard drive. And I actually purchased this one from Amazon. I got this one from Amazon because it was really cheap compared to the other places. I think I paid like 60 or 50 something bucks. And this is the old one actually. Okay. So this is the original one. And this is a Samsung hard drive. And the old, the, and all you do is unscrew these right here. As you can see, it's pretty easy. Just push. And again, the tip or the bit is very important that you get one that is uh, the size appropriate for the screws. You got to try different ones. So it just pops up like this and you just pull it out and switch it and you gotta put it in like that and oops so I just put it in like this fixing computer making a video Mary And as you can see, it's very simple. You just gotta have the right tools. And actually on the, on the one that I got, the new one, this one, the one that I upgraded with, it actually had this thing kind of like stuck like that. So you gotta break it off like, like that. So not all of them are the same size as this, so that this one had the extra piece, just in case you need a you, you need this part so you can hook it up to a, a bigger slot, I guess. So you gotta break it off because it doesn't fit on this one. So you gotta break it off, snap it. But be careful not to crack the hard drive. And that's pretty much it. All you gotta do is uh, put it back. Make sure that they align, these things align. And snap it. And there you go. It's pretty easy. Let's see. So I had already upgraded the the OS and everything so before I even did think about making the video so I'm just gonna show you that it's working
there it goes. So start normally because I just interrupted it. So it should work fine. And this used to be a 16 gigabyte uh, solid state drive and I upgraded to a 32 gigabyte solid state drive from King Spec. Never heard of the company, but it seems to work fine. And it was uh, pretty cheap compared to the others. And the reason that I upgraded um, hard drive space, it was because this computer, I, I think it had uh, XP before, and then I upgraded it to Windows 7, which it would have been better if it was 64, but I didn't want to spend that much money. But 64 is better, actually, or 120 or something. But it works fine, and that's it.